federal prosecutors in the U.S. have revealed the full list of criminal charges against Donald Trump, who's become the first ever former president to face federal criminal prosecution. Mr. Trump is accused of retaining top-secret documents when he left the White House two years ago and of conspiring to obstruct justice. Prosecutors say the documents contain details of the defense and weapons capabilities of the United States and other countries, including details of U.S. nuclear programs, along with information on the potential vulnerability of the U.S. and its allies to military attack. Mr. Trump is accused of taking dozens of boxes of documents from the White House to his Mar-a-Lago resort in Florida and storing them in a ballroom, a bathroom and even a shower. Mr. Trump, who's due to appear in court on Tuesday, insists he's innocent. Here's our North America editor, Sarah Smith. No, Trump's Espionage Act indictments are not like the Rosenbergs. A state charges of ex-president Donald Trump was uncapped Friday disclosing that Trump has been charged with 31 counts of deliberately holding of national defense data, among other indictments, in the confidential dossier inquiry led by distinctive lawyer Jack Smith. As quickly as intelligence dropped that Trump would be indicted under the Espionage Act of 1917, associations to other well-known perpetrators under the act ensued. From history, here are a few of those convicted under Espionage Act of 1917, Aldrich Ames, Ethel and Julius Rosenberg, Jonathan Pollard, Larry Wu Tai Chin, Eugene V. Debs, tweeted by Michael Beschloss, a presidential historian and a biographer and a frequent visitor on MSNBC. The Rosenberg was killed, and most of the others got life imprisonment, some Twitter users triumphantly notable in response. But while it's true those historic characters were sentenced under the Espionage Act, the list is ambiguous. The Espionage Act is an extensive variation and oft revised regulation, overshadowing the most severe espionage indictments and felonies that are not related to spying. Irrespective of your view of the Espionage Act nowadays, it has a rather questionable pedigree. Enacted in 1917 to guard against meddling in military covet procedures, it was first used to impeach anybody who talked in contradiction of World War I, under the sponsorships that doing so was and I quote aiding the enemy, as it was described. The socialist congressman Victor L. Berger, the revolutionary protesters Emma Goldman and the Christian leader Joseph F. Rutherford all were jailed under the act. A 1919 Supreme Court case challenging the law on First Amendment grounds was unsuccessful. On two occasions, Donald Trump showed secret material to outsiders, including military plans, even saying he shouldn't be sharing it. President Biden's trying to keep out of it saying he has nothing to do with this investigation. President Biden, have you spoken to Attorney General Merrick Garland yet? I have not spoken to him at all. I'm not going to speak to him on no comment on what happened. So like a pack of rabid wolves, they attack. Donald Trump already has campaign ads claiming he's a political target. He thinks this will be a vote winner for him. After appearing in... Please join the conversation. Put your comments and suggestions below in the comment section. Thank you for subscribing to this news channel. You will be notified of any breaking news and new post as you become part and parcel of the McCad TV family. Please like and share McCad TV. We love you all. Please support McCad TV Foundation by joining membership and visiting Amazon UK to purchase the displayed books to aid our orphanage projects across Africa.